As massive anti-vaccine protests hit major Canadian cities, including capital city Ottawa, Indian High Commission has issued an advisory for Indian citizens in Canada and those who are planning to travel there. Indians have been asked to take all precautions in light of the ongoing stir and public disturbances in Canada. A special helpline has also been set up for Indians in distress. In fact, protests over COVID-19 restrictions, which have besieged the Canada's capital, Biden to a border bridge with the U.S. on Monday as a convoy of trucks backed up the crossing. Ottawa has been the site of demonstrations by the so-called Freedom Truck Convoy for more than a week now, with hundreds of parked trucks paralyzing the city's business. This is an anti-vaccine protest uh, that is continuing in Canada and now the Indian High Commission has uh, put in certain precautions for Indians who are there and Indians who are planning to travel to, Ota uh, to in fact, Canada. They, in fact, have put in uh, a special helpline uh, which has been set up to actually help the Indians in distress. And um, they have also assured that all precautions uh, should be taken by Indians in light of the ongoing stir and public disturbances. In fact, my colleague Shrinjoy Chaudhary now joins me on the broadcast. Shrinjoy, the visuals on the screen actually say the story which is currently, you know, dotting the entire uh, country and especially the city of Ottawa. These are protests for COVID-19, against COVID-19 restrictions. And Indians who are there, there's a special precaution that has been set and put in place by, you know, the Indian High Commission. There's a high, uh, you know, the helpline also being set up. But what is really happening in Canada? The significance of this, if you can just take our viewers through it. It's very unusual that uh, there are people uh, who are so against the vaccine that will actually help them and their family members. Now, there are anti-vaxxers in large parts of uh, the developed world, uh, in Canada, in the United States, even in Europe. The unfortunate part is that some of them here are demonstrating so violently that the Indian High Commission in Ottawa, mm. which is the capital city, has had to issue a statement, a uh, 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 warning to all Indians who are either there or you are planning to go to Canada on work if necessary, to be careful that there are anti-vaxxers on the streets who are demonstrating violently and to be careful. Now, that is a very, very significant statement. Uh, the uh, Prime Minister, Justin Trudeau, has also uh, tweeted about it, saying that you have every right uh, to express your uh, uh, point of view, but you have no right to be violent, you have no right to uh, hurt other people, and so on. It's a very unusual situation, and surely uh, every Indian who is going there will have to be very careful. Absolutely. Shunjoy, thank you so much for joining me with all those details.